That's the guys. I will now start my walking video in Spike Town, which is in the northern parish of St. Peter. We know this is the Spike Town bypass road. That's the first highway one. This is really your buses. This is our van's road. And the road straight ahead is the road that leads to the north of the island, such as the parish of St. Lucy, and it leads to Haywoods, and Six Men's Bay, and so on. This is now Major Walk in Spikestown, and this is the Spikestown bus depot and bus terminal. Okay, this is the bus depot here and terminal in Spikestown. Spikestown bus terminal and bus depot. So this is where you lower the board the bus and you also and this is where the buses also sleep. Yes, Spikestown is in the parish of St. Peter, which is in the northern part of the island. And this is Spikestown playing field here. And Spikestown Pavilion. Spikestown playing field here. And this is Spike Stone Bus Depot. Spike Stone Bus Depot here, where the buses sleep. Yes, there is Spike Stone Bus Depot. Where the government own blue and yellow big buses. This is where they sleep. And it's also a bus terminal. So it's a terminal and a depot in one. Yes guys, this is the major walk in Spikestown, St. Peter and this is the Spikestown police station here Yes guys, Spikestown bus depot here This is where the bus is right north of the island where they sleep and this is the police station here in Spikestown This is Spike Stone Police Station here. Yes, the police station for St. Peter was originally in Station Hill, St. Peter, which is just above Spike Stone. But in some recent years, it moved down to Spike Stone. This is all major walk, looking back at the bus depot. And Spikestone Pavilion and Pasture. Yes, there is now approaching the Alma Paris, the now defunct Alma Paris Secondary School, which was closed in 2017. It closed its doors in 2017. It was, it was a school for persons who were not well, who were not well academically. Not too bright, we'll go to this school here, Alma Paris Memorial Secondary School in Spike Stone, St. Peter. Yes, it's Spike Stone is Barbados' fourth largest stone. I mean, Barbados' second largest stone after Spike Stone, and it's one of the four, the four towns in Barbados. That's because the now defunct Alma Paris. Secondary school which closed its doors in 2017. It closed its doors because the 2017 common entrance exam. No one passed for that school, so they didn't have any students for the first farm class, so they closed decided to close down the school. Yes, please. This is I'm now approaching Orange Street in Spike Stone. Yes, guys, this is now, I'm now at Orange Street Corner in Spikestown. And this is a lot back at Major Walk on the side of Palmer Paris Secondary School. Yes, guys, this road here leads back to Almond Beach Resort. And this is Orange Street. Orange Street in Spikestown. 
nice case. This is no. I'm now approaching the back of the Spike Stump Esplanade. Yes, guys. This is Spike Stump Beach behind Almond Beach Resort, and you can see all to the north of the island where you will see the Arawak cement plant, which is in the parish of St. Lucie. Yes, guys, you can see all to the Arawak cement plant. This is in St. Lucie, Barbados is northernmost parish. St. Lucie is just after you pass St. Peter. St. Lucie and St. Peter are the two northernmost parishes on the island of Barbados. You can see the Arawak cement plant and you can see all up in the parish of St. Lucie. This is to the northern end of the island. This is the north coast. Yes, guys, this is now behind the esplanade on the jetty in Spite Stone. Yes, guys, Spite Stone, St. Peter. Looking back at Orange Street and Major Walk. Yes, guys, this is behind the jetty and the esplanade in Spite Stone. Yes, the Spike Stone was established in 1630, three years after Hull Town was established. Yes, the Barbados has four towns, the main one being Hull Town, I mean the main one being Bridge Town. The second one is Hull Town. The third is Spike Stone, and the fourth is Oyston Stone. Yes, the Spike Stone is Barbados' the second largest town after Bridge Town, and it was established in 1630. Yes, but now approaching the back of the Esplanade here in Spike Stone. And this is all behind the jetty here in Spike Stone. Yes, this, this is all Spike Stone in the northern parish of St. Peter in Barbados. Spike Stone is just 12 miles away from the capital city of Bridgeton. Yes, please. Yes, please. This is now the back of the jetty. I mean, the back of the esplanade. Uh, this is the Spike Stone jetty. The jetty was closed to the public because it was unsafe to walk on. Last, my last visit. I think it's still closed. We'll come back to that shortly. But right now, this is the Esplanade here in Spike Stone. This is the Esplanade in Spike Stone. Okay, this is the Esplanade showing Spike Stone where you will see St. Peter's Parish Church, the Jordan Supermarket, and the bus, and the jetty, and so on. There's a mural right in the at the front of the Esplanade. That's good. This is St. Peter's Parish Church here. That's good. This is Orange. This is no Orange Street. Spike Stone. And this is the Spike Stone Esplanade here. This is Orange Street where you will find the Orange Street grocer and the bakery and so on. Yes, guys, this is St. Peter's Parish Church, which is in the heart of Spike Stone. It was established in 1837, and it was destroyed by a fire in 1980, and rebuilt in 1983. And right next door to St. Peter's Parish Church is the St. Peter's Daycare and Nursery. Yes, guys, St. Peter's Parish Church in Spike Stone. St. Peter's Parish Church is at the corner of Orange Street. Yes, guys, this is Church Street here. With the S. Wayne Adams store, which was the former Wally store. Wally was a, the garment store, a clothing store, which is in Spice Town for many years until about 2016 or so when it closed. And then S. Wayne Adams moving the S. Wayne Adams store. The 
Adam family. They have lots of stores in Bridgestone as well. And one here is Bridgestone. Yes, guys, this is the site of St. Peter's Parish Church. The Let's Go Thick, Morgan, Georgia. And it is in the heart of Spitestone. St. Peter's Parish Church is an Anglican church in Spitestone, St. Peter. It was built in 1837 and destroyed by fire in 1980. And it was built in 1983. Let's go. This is Church Street, Spitestone. This is Church Street. Let's go to Church Street where you will see the Eddie Supermarket. Let's go to the Eddie Supermarket in Spikestone. Eddie Supermarket in Spikestone, Church Street, Spikestone. We'll take you guys there later. Yes, guys, this is Church Street in Spikestone. And this is Eddie's Wholesale. And this is S.Y. Adam and Son. And this is S.Y. Adam is a clothing store. And it also sells. A few, a, plant, a few small household items as well. But mostly these with clothes. That's because this is St. Peter's Parish Church again and Church Street. There's where our late Prime Minister, Warren Arthur. That is where his funeral was held. And he was laid to rest at Mount Pleasant Memorial Garden, which is just up the hill in the same parish in St. Peter. That is where he laid to rest at Mount Pleasant Memorial Gardens, which is just right next door to the All Saints Anglican Church, which is also in the same parish. Yes, there is St. Peter and St. Lucy are the two northernmost parishes on the island of Barbados. Yes, guys, this is the Esplanade again. And this is the Spikestone Fish Market. Yes, there is the late Prime Minister Owen Arthur is also from this parish, St. Peter. Let's get to the Spikestone Fish Market. The Spikestone Fish Market was redeveloped by Barbados to visit the Fish Market and officially opened on June 16, 2006 by the Right Honourable Owen Arthur, who was the Prime Minister of Barbados at the time and Member of Parliament for the Parish of St. Peter. Yes, they are looking back at Church Street and St. Peter's Parish Church and another part of Eddie's is Eddie's Horse Eddie's Trade Limited we will find the Ellen's Boutique Yes, please Walking over the bridge now the Fisherman's Pub Yes, please all behind the spike stone jetty and this is fisherman's pub and this is the old the cost of money is building here That's good. this is the bridge here and church street spike stone st peter Stone where the old Costa Manning's was, and this is Fisherman's Pub here, which is a restaurant and a bar. And this is the rear end of the S.Y. Adam store. I will take you guys by the jetty. It was closed to the public the last time because some of the boards from the flooring were out, was out, so it wasn't safe for the public to go on. I will take the guys behind the jetty. Yes, because the jetty is still closed to the public. It's being repaired at the present moment. And this is the rear end of the Esplanade again, looking towards Church Street and St. Peter's Parish Church. Yes, 
That's good. Spike Stone is a very historic town. In Barbados, along with Bridgestone, Hollow Town, and Spike Stone. I mean, Bridgestone, Hollow Town, and Oysters. That's good. This is Spike Stone Beach here. And this is the rear end of Fisherman's Pub. And we can see the old the cost of Manning's building. Let's go Spike Stone is in the northern parish of St. Peter in Barbados. And it is 12 miles away from Bridgetown, which is our capital city. Let's go Fisherman's Pub. It's now closed. It's closed for the present moment. At the present moment, because of the coronavirus pandemic that has struck Barbados. And this is the old salt pond here. And the bridge that leads back to the Spike Stone bypass road. Yes, this was the old road that everyone had to use to get a Spike Stone before the bypass road was built. Here's the board here giving a little history of the next town. can best be referred to as a little Bristol. That's it. Little Bristol. Spikestone is best referred to as Little Bristol. And this was the butter shoe store years ago. The butter shoe store when it was in Spikestone. Spike Stone Bay, Spike Stone. And this was the old Spike Stone Church of the Nazarene. End of a KFC restaurant here in Spike Stone. That's the Spike Stone. And this is where Little Bristol ice cream parlor was. And this is the Court Superstore in Spike Stone. This is the town center right here, Spike Stone Town Center. And again, looking back towards the mall, where you'll find the Kentucky restaurant and the court superstore. This is a kind of a mall here. This is the old this is Arlington House or something like that that was destroyed by fire lately. I think it was destroyed by fire sometime last year. Yes, 
This is the heart of Spike Stone. Here. Town Center. We will find the Dollar Wise store, but it's referred to as the three dollar store. Okay, this is all the Spike Stone Town Square here. And you will come across the Jordan Supermarket, which is right here. And this is the Spike Stone Town Center right here. You will find a branch of the Nature's Discount Nutrition Center. The Beauty Exchange, which is a beauty shop, mostly. Sell the beauty products for your hair and so on. This is Upbeat, which is a clothing store. Let's go to Spike Town Town Center. And this is the Eluron Global Inc. Let's go. This is the Spike Town Town Center in the northern parish of St. Peter in Barbados. Yes guys, again Spike Stone is in the parish of St. Peter, which is to the north of the island. St. Peter and St. Lucy are the two northern parishes on the island, but St. Lucy is not northernmost. It's to the top of the island. And St. Lucy is the only parish in Barbados that is named after a female. Female patron saint. Let's go Spike Stone Town Center again. And this is Jordan Supermarket. Let's go. This is where you'll find a Pizza Man Dot restaurant as well. Man Dock restaurant and this is the Spike Stone Church of God here Spike Stone Church of God that was Spike Stone was established in 1630 two years three years after Holton was established Whole tongue is in the western part of St. James in Barbados. It can best be referred to as the gold coast or the platinum coast. And Whole Tongue is very rich and famous still when they come to Barbados, where you'll find the Sandy Lane Hotel. This is the rear end of the Alexander Secondary School, which is one of Barbados' top and older secondary schools as well. The Alexandra Secondary School is situated in Spike Stone as well. This is the entrance to the Alexandra Secondary School in Spike Stone. We'll end the video around here. So this is Spike Stone. Looking back to the Pizza Man Dock and the Jordan Supermarket. And this is the entrance to the Alexandra Secondary School. Thanks for watching and have a blessed evening.